you've mentioned Guy Fisher, Underwood, and many others. Prince from Supreme Team. Prince from Supreme Team. And I'm not saying never, maybe the laws will change and give them a break, but right now they're trying not to let them come home, and that's sad. Because Guy Fisher just got an all drug case. So why is he why he's not getting a chance to come home? Underwood should get a chance to come home. Prince should get a chance to come home. You know? Because they they they're very talented. You know, Underwood had new addition and slave. Guy Fisher had a piece of the Apollo. So why why won't you be you know, revisit that and and so it just ain't life and you can't come home no more. And the irony in that is that Guy Fisher didn't kill anybody, but the person that put him away did all the things. Uh, was responsible for the Everything. one of the three heroin uh, dealers in New York and was set free because he was upset that Guy Fisher was sleeping with his uh, then oh, girlfriend. Um, Tell me about uh, Stevie and some of these characters. When, when you see a guy, a, 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 like for instance, I've seen interviews of Guy Fisher on 60 Minutes. He seems like a very educated, very nice guy. He has a doctor's degree. He has a doctor's degree. I want you to tell me about that because you're one of the first people, a few people that has ever <coughs> brought that up about Guy Fisher. I mean, when I first came to jail, he educated me a lot, and he's, he's he told me what to watch out for, but he's. He's, you know, he's very smart. He's not a dumb man, and you know, he bettered himself. The whole thing is, a person like that shouldn't be in jail for the rest of his life. A person like that should get another chance to come home and be with their families. Now, like I said, you're giving these guys life for just selling drugs. That's that's amazing when you when you you orchestrate for the drugs to come into the country. You orchestrate for the guns to come into this country. So. How can you just lock these people up forever? You know? That's Underwood should get another chance. Prince should, all of them should get another chance at life after they do maybe, all right, the ones that got the bodies, maybe do 20, 25 years and then be revisited, see what they did for the 20, 25 years while they locked up. And if they did something, and I'm just talking about the ones that had the bodies, along with the drug cases, because the drug cases should be released now. The ones that get the bodies with the drug cases, they should be revisited after they do a certain amount of time to make sure that they can come back home and don't want to do that again. But the ones that didn't have the bodies, they should be revisited now and let go because it's, it's, it's no violence in the case. Just like they're giving bails out with no violence, they should release the drug dealers with no violence right now.